Hello and welcome to this presentation. We discuss schedule-based server policy and show you how to create a policy and associate it with a server as the IAAS self-service user. The self-service portal policies feature allows you to control the servers, virtual machines, based on schedule or performance events. A policy must support an assembly instance, a tier instance, or an Oracle VM guest. When you associate instances to a policy, make sure the instance is correctly referenced by the policy. For example, relate an assembly instance policy to an assembly instance and not an Oracle VM guest. The policy can work one time or frequently, and you can even set up policies to work at specific dates and times in the future. Now, let's see how to set a schedule policy and associate it with an IAAS server instance. In this session, I'm logged in as Sales Self Service User 1, and the home page of the Self Service Portal is displayed. Click on the Policies tab to display the policies interface. There is a policy on the list with the name Tuesday PM Down. The settings of this policy are shown below the policies list and to the left. The policy was created to stop assembly instances on Tuesday night at 5 p.m. We will create another policy which will start associated assembly instances Tuesday night at 9 p.m. Click Create and click on the Schedule Policy option. In the Create Schedule Policy interface, enter a descriptive name. Here, use the available name and change it to Tuesday PM Up. Keep the target type value of Oracle Assembly Instance. Leave the policy action value with Start. Click the calendar icon to set the date and time. Select the nearest Tuesday and change the time to 09 hours, 00 minutes, and 00 seconds. Leave the PM option selected and change the time zone to U.S. Mountain Time. Now click OK. Set repeat to every N weeks and leave the frequency set at one week. Click OK in the upper right corner of the screen. The policies interface returns with a confirmation message at the top. Now we can associate the new Tuesday PM up policy with the assembly instance generic WLS01. Click on Add under Associations below the policy list. A dialog box appears, enabling you to select from available assembly instances. Click on the list entry for generic WLS01 and click on Select. The association appears on the list of associations for the policy selected from the list above. The two policies work together to shut down and start up this one instance. However, you can associate either of the existing policies with another server and create an alternative policy as needed. For now, we can see that the WLS Generic 01 server will be started at 9 p.m. Tuesday after it has been shut down at 5 p.m. Tuesday. This ends the presentation. Thank you for watching.